గుడ్ మార్నింగ్ వ్యూయర్స్ వెల్కమ్ టు కోనసీమ షార్ట్ హ్యాండ్ క్లాసెస్ దిస్ ఈజ్ ఆఫ్ వన్ ట్వంటీ వర్డ్స్ పర్ మినిట్ స్పీడ్ గెట్ రెడీ ఫైవ్ సెకండ్స్ మిస్టర్ చైర్మన్ సార్ ఐ థ్యాంక్ యూ వెరీ మచ్ ఫర్ గివింగ్ మీ ఏ ఛాన్స్ టు మీట్ సమ్ ఆఫ్ ది పాయింట్స్ రైజ్డ్ బై హానబుల్ మెంబర్స్ ఆన్ ది ఆపోజిట్ సైడ్ ఫస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఆల్ it has been said that the male nurse can be given further training for two or three months and can be used as a health assistant i may inform the house that the scale of pay of a male nurse is higher than that of a health assistant so if we give training to the male nurse and post him as health assistant he will be getting a salary less than what he would get as male nurse so far as primary health centers are concerned we are now thinking of a scheme by which better training can be given to meet both the public health requirements and those on the curative side then mention has been made about the extension of the honorary medical officer system in state hospitals the honorary system has been working well i may point out that the essential duty posts are now being held by the fully paid officers of the government but the difficulty is in getting honorary doctors especially in the mafsil the response is very poor in the cities to some extent we have been getting them at present the director of medical services recommends every year creation of more posts of honorary medical officers but we find it difficult to get sufficient number of doctors then as regards the integration of the medical and public health departments the matter is now under consideration as a matter of fact both the departments are now combined in some states but it is not so in our state we are now trying to see whether we also can integrate both the departments it has also been mentioned at the recent conference of health ministers that it will be a very good step if both these departments are integrated now in the primary health centers there is much overlapping of staff in certain places and in some other places there is shortage of staff then reference was made to the admission of a blind person in the general hospital and his discharge from it after 2 or 3 days it was also stated that he was consequently thrown into the streets that such things should not happen in future and that appropriate steps should be taken to see that such persons were taken care of by handling them over to some institution or some responsible persons i am glad to say that the resident medical officer of the general hospital has reported that sanction has been given for employing attendants from contingencies to take care of blind persons whenever necessary as regards the actual happening if the honorable member gives me more facts i will have the matter inquired into then mention has been made about the issue of medicines to non resident officers now they are treated with medicines that are available in the hospital but if they are not available there they are required to purchase them privately and give them to the doctor for injection or for any other purpose it has been said that if the hospital itself makes necessary arrangements to purchase such medicines and supply them to patients it is certain that the cost of such medicines will be at least 
20 percent less than the market price but my own information is that it will not be less but on the other hand it will be more of course i do not know the reasons letter from sripati and company mudurai to the secretary students cooperative stores national high school karaikudi dear sir we thank you very much for your kind inquiry of the ninth instant we are glad to note that you are interested in buying your requirements of stationary articles from us for which we are grateful to you in the first place we wish to inform you that we are dealing in school and college textbooks notebooks and various items of stationery that may be required by students for the purpose of their studies we have been in the field for the last 10 years you will be pleased to know that we have been getting regular orders from various schools and colleges for our articles we take it as evidence that our goods are very much liked as we take care to see that they are of very good quality in this connection we wish to inform you that if you want notebooks of any special quality or design we will be willing to consider your request and take necessary steps to meet your requirements because we are aware that various institutions require different types of material we enclose a copy of our catalog and price list the prices are liable to change from time to time we hope and trust that we will be hearing further from you about your requirements at an early date yours faithfully